Let's create a tree map using Power BI. Now a tree map is a hierarchy chart. And in Power BI, you can go to your tree map visual, select it, and it will drop right into your report view. You can go ahead and expand it and it will give you an indicator of what that tree map will look like. So the information that we're gonna add in our tree map, or we're gonna be doing some, let's do this, this, and then let's go to select all, just gonna take off food and spices, all right? So now that we have a tree map, we can kind of see here that the largest amount of cells is going to be the biggest box or the rectangle or square shape, really rectangle shape. So we have the shortest, the smallest amount of cells is it's going to kind of fall right here in the bottom right, while the larger amount of cells is going to fall up here in the upper left on the left hand side. So your bigger cells on the left while your smaller cells will be on the right. So the good thing about this tree map is you also get some indicators. So this lets you know that this, this is bread with a color indicator as well. Beef, beer, appetizers, apples, and soup. So if we come here to our regions like this, now we get a indicator showing us that this, these regions have all the sales. These, these are the regions that's given these product categories, the sales. So for bread, West, Midwest, and Northeast are the ones that's kind of tailoring the sales of bread and so on and so forth. So you can kind of see that and it keeps the color indicators the same. And now with addition, we have the regions to it. So we can see what regions had what sales, what regions didn't have any sales in bread. So we can kind of see here that the most sales in bread was made by the South region. So we see bread and then we see South here, while the least amount of sales was made by the Northeast region. And if we come to format, there's a few things that we can do here and we can toggle the legend on, or we can toggle the legend off. If we toggle this legend on, come up here and we can kind of select appetizer and, and get a, a more a uh, closer breakdown of appetizer cool feature that they probably could add is a zoom and we can also turn it back off we have some colors here where you can go there and, and kind of change the colors so if we change this to light green or well, green that'll do that we got some labelers so these data labels will kind of give us some indication on sales so now we can kind of see what those sales look like and then we can come here to increase the size we, if we so choose we can also make it bold unbold it and then we can kind of come to category labels we can turn them off we can turn them on and we can increase the font and now you should know how to create a tree map in power bi